I'm in love with the coco. Hey everyone, it's me, Gladys Nicole, and I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how to do a do-it-yourself lip scrub. Cause ain't nobody got time to be walking around this summer with crusty lips, like no. <laughs> if you're excited to see this video, give this video a big old thumbs up. Also share it with all your friends and um, subscribe if you have not subscribed already. Click the subscribe button down there, up there, over there, wherever I'm gonna put it or yeah, girl. So if you're ready to watch this video, let's dive right in. Oh, and thumbs this video up if y'all love my shirt. So what you will need to make this lip scrub are um, food coloring, any color of your choice. I happen to use green because that's all I had. <laughs> and then um, sugar, granulated sugar of course. And then you're going to need a bowl for your lip scrub. And then any flavor of your choice. I'm using vanilla. So to start off, take two t little teaspoons of sugar into the bowl. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my food coloring and drop four droplets into the bowl. Next, I'm going to take a tablespoon, I mean <laughs> a teaspoon of pure vanilla extract for my flavor and add that also into the bowl. Lastly, into the mixture, you're going to want to put in honey or oil, any of your choice. Um, olive oil is the best, but I didn't have that, so I had to use another type of oil. And then you're just going to want to keep mixing it together, and yeah. Baking soda! I got baking soda! Baking soda! So technically, I just used canola vegetable oil instead of honey. I'm in love with the coco. I'm in love with the coco. I got it for the lolo. So for the actual application process of exfoliating your lips, you're gonna want to take the scrub, um, rub it onto your lips in circular motions, and then just rub your lips together for two minutes. After that's done, you're going to want to just wipe off your lips with a paper towel or something or a tissue paper and water. Just wipe off your lips to get off that sugar. And you're going to have a lot of excess lip scrub left, so what you can do is just cover it up with foil or plastic wrap or just use a closable container. And when you're done with this all, just moisturize your lips with some chapstick or any moisturizer of your choice. And we're done. And that was it for the video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And comment down below any video requests or any other type of video I should do next or if you want to see another DIY. And also don't forget to follow me on social media. My Instagram is right here. My Snapchat is also right there. And thank you all so, so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. If you've ever liked a video, commented, or even subscribed, mm, love you all so much. Bye. I, I, I'm in love with the coco.